Hi, it's Maria. Today is Friday, January 9th, and this is my update for my first week of the 90 Day Challenge. Um, the 90 Day Challenge started on January 1st, Thursday, so Wednesday night completed one week, and I joined the gym. Um, I did really good this week. I went to the gym every single day, and a couple of times I went twice a day. And um, the 1,400 calorie thing that I had originally planned, it's not going to work. Um, before, when I did 1,400 calories, I was fine. I was never hungry. You know, maybe every once in a while I actually craved something, but uh, hunger wasn't an issue. But since I started working out, um, I did get hungry, and I needed a little bit. I realized I was going to need to up my calories just a tiny bit due to how hard I was working out. Because I'm not, I'm not just, uh, you know, doing a few calisthenics or getting on the treadmill for a little bit. I, I was actually hitting it pretty hard. And I do cardio every single day, and I've been doing weight training. So I'm expecting to gain some weight there due to the muscle uh, that I'll gain. And I did take my measurements. Um, on the day before I started so that I would know I don't have them in front of me right now but that way at the end of the 90 days I'll know how how well I did I won't go by the pounds so much as the inches um, so I have a, ca a calendar here and I've marked everything every single day um, the gold stars are for when I do really really well and see I have two green I have a couple of green stars and some gold stars. Uh, green, green is for when I burn less than two, uh, 350 calories. So there were three green stars and four gold stars for the week. I don't give myself a gold star unless I've burned more than 350 calories. So on those days I took it kind of easy. But I have my totals here. Calories burned for the first seven days, I burned 3,509 calories. I consumed 11,371 calories. Um, so that the calories that I consumed averaged out to 1,624 calories a day. But um, let's see, after you take away the calories that I burned, the daily average is 980 calories so it's it's as if I was only eating 980 calories a day which would not be good if I were actually doing that um, let's see there are the best day I had was on Sunday I burned a thousand twenty four calories on that one day which was good because on that one day I consumed 1900 calories but it ended up like it was 877. Um, there was one more thing I wanted to say. Uh, let's see. Today is Friday, so it was Wednesday. Wednesday I did for the first time ever five miles. And um, I was, you know, always walking before it, but I would do like three miles, three and a quarter, three and a half. And on Wednesday, I decided to try five miles, and I did it just fine. Um, my heart was fine, my body was fine, but my feet were not. The socks I was wearing were not so great, and they felt like they were causing me to have blisters, so I did stop at five miles. But honestly, I think I could have gone more, which is really exciting, because um, like I've said in previous videos, when I first started, I couldn't even do a quarter mile without feeling like I was dying. And I remember getting so excited the first time I completed one mile. And I never thought that I would get to the day that I could do five miles easily. So, I don't know what my limit is, but maybe I'll test it. Okay, as for the weight, um, two days before I started, uh, I weighed myself. And for some freaking reason, I was up at to 208. And um, the last time I had given an update I was 199 I was in Wonderland and but over Christmas I made crap loads of cookies and I ate a crap load of cookies and then we had a lot of leftovers and nobody was eating them my husband wasn't really eating them my kids weren't eating them so I was kind of stuck eating them because um, I I grew up my mom taught me not to waste any food I did not overeat like when I would get a plate it was just a normal small plate 
but it was stuff like mashed potatoes, stuffing, deviled eggs, so it was not good. Um, so I'm assuming that's why I gained some of the weight plus the cookies and stuff. So I did eat the leftovers kind of dreading it. I wasn't, um, you know, because I knew it was going to screw me up, but at the same time I wasn't, I didn't feel good about throwing away that much food. I did end up throwing some away towards the end, but it wasn't the whole, you know, I wasn't going to throw away that much. So after it got down to hardly nothing, I went and it threw it away. I didn't want to finish um, finish it off. So anyway, um, it was I was up to 208, and some of that was the fact that usually when I weigh myself, I'm in very light clothing and flip flops. On that day, I was in jeans, and I did have my running shoes on, and I weighed my running shoes. They're just a little over a pound. So I don't know how much of that was actual weight gain, but in those since nine days ago, I dropped those nine pounds that I gained. Um, I'm back to 199 as of Wednesday night weighed myself 199 so now I'm back to the lowest weight that I've ever been at in over 10 years so I'm excited now because um, since the holiday weight is gone and I'm back down to where you know where I was before that um, it's I'm good to go from here I mean I can't wait to see what I actually lose this week so from that 208 I'm figuring Oh, there was water weight too, because I noticed like my wedding ring that usually wants to just fall right off my finger um, wouldn't, you know, you had to pull it off. So I'm guessing about five pounds was not real uh, actual fat gain, which means I, I probably lost about four pounds this past week, four to five pounds. And I worked for that four or five pounds. And um, I'm going to step it up even more. Um, I am like obsessed with the gym. I love the gym. I can't believe that I've never done this before. Um, the gym that I have, that I, I don't have it, I, the gym that I go to has like a television on every piece of equipment and its own remote and you just plug in your headphones, you can watch a movie, you can watch the news, you can watch music videos, whatever you want. And so um, you don't even feel like you're working out. You're just like watching TV and before you know it, you know, you've been working out an hour and uh, burned however X amount of calories. So I really like it. I'm, but I, I think I'm a little bit too obsessed. I, I think all day about the gym. Can't wait to go to the gym. In fact, as soon as I'm done doing this video and uploading it, I'm going to get dressed and go to the gym. And um, I'm actually like dreading that I have a part-time job because that takes away on those days, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays, I work from 8 to 5. Then I got to come home and cook dinner and stuff. And that takes away from my time at the gym. Because if I could, I would go at least twice a day, every single day. I absolutely love it. As every calorie ticks by that I've burned, I'm just, I'm, I get so excited. And um, I know I'm totally going to rock this 90 days. I can't wait to update next week and see how I did and um, I hope everybody's doing well. Thank you Danny so much for issuing this 90 day challenge and good luck to everybody. Bye.